Let's get busy. Well, to all you party people who are here at the show, you're listening to the sounds of the mighty Flectones. Howard's on the harp, Victor on the bass, and Roy on the drums. It must have come from out of space. Baylor on the banjo, he's the big Flectone. He wants to take the banjo to galaxies unknown. <laughs> Bela's on the banjo rocket. He's Uncle Dave making in Chick Corea's body. <laughs> so he just plays a banjo. He doesn't really, he's not a, he, he can be a banjo player, but he just happens to hold a banjo and th these things come out of his head through his hands onto this instrument that he's holding. It could be anything and he would be doing the same thing with it. He's, he just happened to choose a banjo. I had always known what Bela wanted to do his banjo and if he ever got a band together that could play the things that he had going through his mind all the time. The band is built on Bela's writing and his arranging skills and now he's got some other guys in the band that interpret things the same way he does. They're all like, they're like gloves. It's a brand new thing and a lot, of, a lot of people are really liking it. I really like it. The cool thing about it is everyone's flexible enough, I'm talking about being on your toes, everybody's flex flexible enough to, um, to, 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 to go with it. If it changes a little bit, oh, oh, it sped up, hey, let's groove with it there, or, or oh, it got real quiet, let's keep it there for a second, you know? It's not like, oh, that's not the way it's supposed to be. Stiffen up, you know? That, that's the way you mess up improvisation, is by being scared of it when it gets different. everyone in the band understands the concept that, that they are going to get a chance. It's in the show. They know they're going to get their shot to really blow and play, you know. And so it makes them comfortable about laying low in other songs and making everyone else sound good.